Color of Change is fighting for a more human, less hostile world for Black people in our country. At the center of that work is a commitment to Black joy. We kicked off the year with our inaugural Black History Now Awards, honoring the educators, students, and activists who are committed to keeping Black history in our schools. And the celebration didn't stop there. We partnered with IMG's New York Fashion Week and the 64th Annual Grammy Awards to implement the first inclusion rider, ensuring their productions were diverse in front of the camera and behind the scenes. This summer, Color of Change hosted a series of carnivals for families, doubling down on the importance of including black history in our classrooms and communities. Color of Change brought back black women's brunches and convened black men's tables, honoring the leadership and care that creates real change in our community. Color of Change remains committed to the safety of our communities. We believe that the only way to disrupt cycles of harm is to move money from unsuccessful policing tactics to diverse safety measures that actually keep us safe. This year, our campaign to demand that missing black girls in Kansas get the media attention they deserve, and our campaign that demanded the New York District Attorney drop charges against domestic violence survivor Tracy McCarter, were two examples of the ways we show up for black people every day. Color of Change was a leading voice to call on President Biden to cancel student debt as a part of our broader work to achieve economic justice for black people. We have been fighting for tech accountability for years, and this year we upped the ante with the Black Tech Agenda Scorecard to hold corporations and the government accountable for black safety online. We fought to get broadcasters to drop the far-right One American News from their channels, and we won. And after Musk assumed control of Twitter and hate speech on the platform skyrocketed, we were integral in getting advertisers to boycott the platform until they have real processes in place to protect black people from hate and misinformation. And we are proud to be a part of the long legacy to protect black voters' freedom. And this year's midterm election was no different. Color of Change fights for black people every year because our communities are our priority. Join us in the fight.